How much mulch should you use? Well, considering one of the main purposes of using mulch for erosion control is to prevent raindrop impact, which prevents the initial stages of erosion and, and prevents dirty water from leaving the site, uh, you need to put enough down that covers the soil. So here we have a, an example of straw mulch placed on a, an area that was used as a, a soil waste pile and uh, do a little inspection here. Look close, you can see soil through here, so that's not enough straw. A few feet away, you can't see any soil. And if you dig down a little bit, just a couple inches, there's some soil. So my rule of thumb is a ton and a half per acre, or 3,000 pounds per acre, um, or and or put down enough so you can't see the soil and then put down a little bit more and that's plenty if you're putting mulch over seed grass seed you want uh, enough to cover the soil but you don't want so much that it's gonna smother out the seed when it tries to grow starts to grow so this actually is a good installation for the most part. There are a few places where soil is showing through. But again, looking at this, soil's covered. And that's pretty much what you need. Although it's, it is a little thin right here, now that I'm moving it around. Over in here is a little bit better. Some regulatory agencies, jurisdictions, specify thickness, which I think is okay, but I certainly wouldn't go more than about three inches with straw. I've seen some regulations say put four or five inches, which I think is way overkill. Anyway, straw mulch.